Talent Hunt Season 1. Hello everyone, a very good afternoon to you all and welcome to the first edition of the Sparkle Talent Hunt Season 1 powered by Dada Multimedia International. Dada Multimedia is one of the foremost players in the music and multimedia industry based here in Nigeria. With our aim at creating and expressing God's image through the media, via text, pictures, songs and videos through excellence, Dada Multimedia offers varieties of services within the scope of the multimedia industry ranging from music and video purpose production, sound and light management, multi-track music like recording and sequencing, Afro-media, marketing and advertisements, event management, and has superb technical abilities and compliance with international standards with our trained and internationally certified personnel would give you the standards that we've set to raise and express all our services with excellence. And now, why are we here? It's the Sparkle Talent Hunt with me in the studio. It's no other person than Pastor Kunle Elisami. Good to have you on the show, yeah, sir. Thank you <laughs> so much. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, good evening viewers. Thank you for having me around uh, Joshua Blend. I'm so excited to be in the studio with you today. Thank you're, you very much. You're welcome, sir. You're welcome, sir. Looking all great as always. Thank you. <laughs> the same as you. You're looking great all the time. Yeah, you're welcome, sir. So I really want to know why the Sparkle Talent Hunt? Um, Sparkle Talent on uh, basically it's God's given vision uh, to us, especially to the family uh, Dad and Multimedia International. Um, 2015, I was on a journey and uh, God revealed to me in a vision that raised me a court. I will ride upon the court and I'll be glorified. And in return, I will have them rewarded. I was confused in a moment, but just a little into the vision, the Lord took me to the book of Luke chapter 19. I would love to read that scripture to you um, from verse 30. It said, go to the village ahead of you, and as you enter it, you will find a court tied there, which no one has ever reading. Untie it and bring it here. If anyone asks you, why are you untying it? Say, the Lord needs it. And the vision became clear. You recall just a little back into the story when Jesus was to ride into Jerusalem. You know, he, he called the disciples that they should go into the city that is already a prepared court tied somewhere. And God is saying, raise me the same manner, a court which I will ride upon to be glorified. You recall this court basically was unexperienced, young, not known. This is exactly what God is saying concerning Sparkle. It's a raise me court, men and women who I will ride upon. Doesn't matter, they are not experienced so much as you may think, they are possibly not known, but God said. If they can be available, as the same court was available for Jesus, I will ride upon them mm. and I will glorify myself in them and they will be rewarded. And I would like to just read to you. It said, raising talented and gifted singers set apart as court that God's presence will ride upon them and be honored in return. So we're excited that, that we're doing this. It's also a part of give, give back to the, to, to, you know, to, to the Christendom, raising men and women who, who God has gifted, you know, to, to, to help them to become what God wants them to become. Remember, the Bible says, the gift of a man, make a room for him. And uh, I trust God that for the people who have been part of this vision, who have made themselves available, just like the court was available, that at the end of the day, they will see a turnaround in their visions, in their ministries, and in, in, in the gift that God has given to them. Because our purpose, basically, after this moment, is to be able to sharpen, help, develop, and train you know, these young men and women to become what God has actually designed them to become. And I'm excited that, that, that we're part of this. Mm. If you can hear, you can hear from the horse's mouth and it says that Sparkle Talent Hunt has come to stay. Sparkle Talent Hunt is here to stay. So, sir, would this be running annually or how would Sparkle Talent Hunt be going? By the grace of God, um, 
I'm excited to be part of this. And to the glory of God, it's going to be a transgenerational. Mm. As long as Jesus tarries, mm. sparkle talent on has come to stay. We'll have it on a yearly basis by the grace of God. And what has sponsorship been for Sparkle Talent Hunts? Are there sponsors for this wonderful event or it's just, let, we want to know about that. Um, that's exciting to know uh, <laughs> that you, <laughs> you ask uh, that question. Uh, basically at the moment, uh, because this is a season one, uh, you know, in every seed, there is a tree. Mm. And we're trusting God that season one of Talent On yes. is the seed. Yes. We're trusting that after season one, when people see how we've been a blessing to, to, to the Christendom, to be a blessing to the society, um, we're trusting that by season two, we will have uh, people who God has blessed who want to be part of this because it's our interest to raise more people. Yes. And as you know, in the scripture, the Bible says, you know, the part of the just man shineth brighter and brighter, and the glory of the latter surely shall be greater than the former. That's our expectation. Mm, that's so interesting to know. Remember, if you weren't able to be a part of the first season, Sparkle Talent Hunt, it's here to stay, and it's transgenerational. So stay there and don't go nowhere. Sparkle Talent Hunt Season 1.